In this video, we are going to show you how sometimes neck bend distension creates a confusion in the undergraduate's mind or the student's mind that maybe the jugular venous pressure is raised. If you can see here, we are looking at the external jugular vein which is intermittently distending. We can see the waveforms also and it is intermittently distend uh, distending and going to the upper part of the angle of mandible it may create a confusion that JEP is raised but if you see here when the patient is inspiring it is changing with respiration in inspiration it is completely collapsible you can see here during inspiration the JEP is completely collapsing and during expiration it is appearing full to avoid this complication also to avoid this confusion also let us go for hepatojugular reflux that will tell us if there is an occult raise in JVP or latent raise in JVP which is manifesting like this with the fullness of the vein. Let us go for hepatojugular reflux test. So I am going for a hepatojugular reflux. I am compressing the abdomen. And you can see here. I will again compress the abdomen. Look at the JVP. Yes, it has gone up again and you see in less than 10 seconds it is again fully collapsible. It is fully collapsible now. So it is confirmed that it is not raised JVP. And sometimes in elderly persons, the valves in the veins are usually degenerated. So the that is why it creates a false impression of raised JVP, fullness of the vein, but actually it is not fullness, it is due to, that fullness is due to degeneration of the valves leading to a false interpretation of distended vein. Thank you.